got almost as many kids as he does Ezekiel Chokes. Here is the heavyweight hopeful Alexi Olenek. This guy's more than 40 fights over 500 in a pro career that dates all the way back to 1996. It's unbelievable when you watch Alexi Olenek compete. He goes in there and he seems as disinterested as anyone that I've ever seen step into an octagon. But the moment he gets his hands on you, no one's nickname is more fitting. Yeah. The bold constrictor. You feel like you're wrapped within his limbs and you cannot find an escape. Some of the submissions he has are truly unbelievable. When he hit that Ezekiel choke at the bottom, neither one of us, John, understood right. why his opponent was tapping. Yeah, and that was Victor Pesta, and then he got Junior Albini with that famed Ezekiel choke as well. Most people seem to know what's coming. They're dismissive of it. Alexio Linick is a submission magician. He'll try to get another win here tonight. Fighting Iron Mike Tyson. He is ferocious and seemingly the speed and power are still there at his advanced age. Mike Tyson trying to make headway here in the UFC tonight. The baddest man on the planet, ready to reward his supporters once again here tonight. get you our tale of the tape for this heavyweight championship fight. Here is Bruce Buff. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. <laughs> Nice slip to avoid the left. Oh! 
Absolutely punished by that hit. Well, DC kind of just playing with him at this point, right? You think he's got to go in and just get him out of there. Well, he's trying, but he gets a little bit angry. Oh! That'll do it! Oh! The official decision is in. Here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean's called a stop in this contest at one minute, 52 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout. And